And we are back, and it has been a minute since I played. I have very little uh, memory of what the hell is going on here. Um, so let me take a quick look at my map. I guess I'm getting ready to go talk to everybody here. Um, yeah, I'm going to talk to everyone I can. Um, so I'm going to start off going to the left, to my left. All right, so let's do this. So we're just going to talk to everyone. Okay. Take a quick look at my map. I'm here, so... All right. So you can't go back into the embassy suites. It's only in mission. Um, what's this? Thank you again, Earth Clan. Our military strength is minimal, but we are proud to help as we can. Cool. Okay. I don't know why I can still talk to you if your mission is done, but whatever. I hoped you'd come. I won't remain here much longer. What are you doing on the Citadel, Samara? I suppose I came to say goodbye. Faler is safe, and Rila is at rest. I felt the need to speak to you before heading to battle. I want you to know there is no one else I'd rather see leading us in our last hours. We'll make the galaxy proud. The largest fleet in history is already on our side. It is impressive. Most would have deemed such an alliance impossible. But Shepard, be sure to assess your force's strengths and weaknesses before setting out. What are the other Justicars doing for the war? Most have made it home. They will attempt to hold Thessia. With the odds we face, it's possible our order will no longer exist after this war. There's that few of you? Our numbers were never great. We must prepare to sacrifice ourselves, if that is what's required. Was being a Justicar worth it, if that's how it all ends? The Justicars were formed to bring order to a world that laughs at the notion. The role is solitary. Its demands are lonely and uncompromising, often to the point of pain. But following the code left me with no regrets. Take that for what you will. You know, I never asked you if your code has anything useful on fighting Reapers. Treat them as any other enemy. Show no quarter, mercy, or weakness. The only difference is the scale of our foe. The code is too strict to account for such... small discrepancies. Is that how you see it too? An odd question, coming from the Spectre who killed her third Reaper on Rannoch. Will Falaire be alright in the Monastery? Or what's left of it? We spoke for some time. It won't be easy. But if there is a way to survive... Falaire will find it. It was... good to see her again. Perhaps it's unseemly for a Justicar to dwell so much on her family. I'm just happy things worked out. I was fortunate that Falaire saw things so clearly. And it would have turned out quite differently without your intervention. Thank you. Glad to be of help. Good luck out there, Samara. You as well. I don't know if you believe in such things. But Goddess, go with you, Shepard. We'll both be tested in fire soon enough. We damn sure will. Okay, what's this dude? Urgently, human, I must speak to you on behalf of my people. What is it? 
holding sorrow. Takuna, my home world, the Reapers have come. Holding sorrow, our warriors are under siege, but your forces can rescue them. Urgently, please. All the other races have turned us aside. How do your people fight? Proudly, with BI-assisted infantry. Our soldiers carry heavy weapons into battle mounted on their backs. Mixed pride and shame, our enemies have called us living tanks, as well as names less flattering. I'll take the Normandy as soon as we have time. Relief. Thank you, Commander. Small hope. Perhaps we can evacuate some of our civilians when your forces arrive. Anxiously, I will remain here for news. Please hurry. Takuna burns. Okay, well, we're going to be uh, seeing to that. Because I damn sure want to help the El Elcor. Alright, so there's like nobody else in here. Alright, so we did that area, we did that area. Okay, so let's take a quick look at the map. Alright. Okay. Let's keep it moving. Now. Alright, so we, all we need to do is just... Follow the walls. Okay, so do we need to talk to him? Let's talk to him, see if there's anything new. Hey, Shepard. I have to admit, the place feels safer with you here. Everyone's walking around in a daze. Or in my case, limping. And I wonder if we'll ever be the same. These are dark days for all of us. Okay, I think we already talked to this one, right? Yeah, we already spoke. We already had this conversation. You got your work cut out for you. You and me both, Shepard. Yeah, you got that right. Now, we already searched his office, so we're going to go back out. And this is the Spectre spot, right? Alright, now, we already... That's... Okay, let's take a look at these two. Okay, what can I do here? Good to see you're all right, Shepard. Miranda, what's going on? Couldn't meet in person. The Citadel is too dangerous right now. I heard about the attempted coup. Yeah, with Kai Lang's help, Udina nearly seized control. Kai Lang? That slippery bastard's still alive? He's alive and right in the middle of all this. That complicates things. I'll be on my guard. Look, I don't have much time, but I learned what happened to my sister. Where is she? I don't know that yet, but my father was definitely responsible. If he's done anything to her, I'll kill him. Miranda. Shepard, listen. I'm being hunted by Cerberus assassins, a lot of them. I need to stay out of sight. What? Why? I heard a rumor, maybe more, that my father is working on something for the elusive man. Something big. Why would your father be working with the elusive man? Especially now. My father is ruthless about preserving his legacy. Legacy? He has an obsession with making his mark in history. Ensuring his dynasty lasts forever. And you think the elusive man made him an offer? Exactly. Whatever's going on with your father can't be good. We have to figure this out. I agree, but... I need to do this myself. It's time I stopped running from him. You're sure? Yes. I can't think straight until I know Ari is safe. Be careful. I can't promise that, Shepard. Could you? No. I couldn't. I want to help. I want to get in there. Okay. Terran access codes. Okay. 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 
Okay, see the number of civilian warrants in an attempt to find evidence that would incriminate Cerberus and informants. Tab public surveillance feeds but do not have legal authorize. Okay, nothing to do with that. Field request for a civilian militia to defend the Citadel. Many CSEC officers believe it would benefit. Okay. okay, let's authorize. Medical supplies, we're gonna authorize. Let's authorize. And commendation. Captain Riley, nominated for Valor. Let's do this. Let's do that. Okay. All right. And this is just like stuff I can buy. Reaper code fragment. Um, okay. Gas target jamming tech. Cover for deploying these jamming units in the Presidium would hinder enemy forces in case of another Citadel saving because the lines cannot formally support Eclipse Mert this technology. Okay, we're gonna buy that. And Reaper Code, a sorry war strategists have encountered difficulty predicting Reaper movements due to poor understanding of Reaper thought process. The scavenger is willing to sell a Reaper processor that he discovered among the debris from Sovereign's attack on the Citadel. This intel could dramatically improve. Yeah. Okay. Cool. That was worth it. No. Wrong spot. We went meant to go out. We meant to leave. Okay. Okay, now, is there anything I need over here? No. So, is there anybody in here? Medina's old office. I want all remaining files secured and marked for Tentron clearance only. Commander Shepard, thank you for coming. Did you find something? The Council has ordered a full review into Donald Udina's activities. We're still piecing together his coup attempt. But that isn't why I asked you here. The situation is growing urgent for my people. We're aware your Crucible is still missing a key component. The Catalyst. Do you know something? Not exactly, but there is a artifact on our homeworld, Thessia, known only to highest levels of my government. What is it? With any luck, it's a means to help you locate the catalyst. The artifact is kept in a temple located at these coordinates. I've ordered a scientific team to meet you there. If this artifact is so important, why keep it hidden? Every species in the Citadel has its secrets, Commander. But this one, in the wrong hands, would upset the balance of galactic power. The Reapers are doing that right now. Which is why I'm bringing this to you. I appreciate the help. It's you who will be helping us. The Matriarchs are growing desperate. For the first time in our history, Thessia is vulnerable. For all our intellect, we're outmatched by Reaper firepower. I'll do what I can. Whether you know it or not, you've become the sole ray of hope in a very dark night. Goddess be with you. All right, well, that was everything. Okay, so that was all of that. I can't even go back in there. Wow, okay. So we're going back one to the uh, elevator. By the way, what floor is this? Doesn't really say. Uh, points of interest, the Citadel embassies, it doesn't really say what floor this is, so. All right, so nothing says what floor this is. So Citadel embassies. Okay. Five, four, three. Areas tagged of interest to you 
are highlighted on the elevator menu. Alright, so I'm gonna go to D2 and see what happens. If you have a question, please consult NFC. One moment, please. Alright. All right, now before I leave, five, four, three, yeah, okay, all right, that's right, that's what we want, exit, all right, we're good. So anybody here I need to talk to, map, Takas, James, and Ashley, all right, so we're just going to do the usual, we're going to go clockwise, I don't need to talk to any of these people apparently. Alright, so I see Ash. Alright. Alright, let's go talk to Ash. Commander, thanks for coming. This must be really hard on your sister. I'm very sorry for her loss. See her go through this. Damn it. There I go again. I hope Sarah can find some peace here. I'm glad I can be here for her. She wanted me to say something about her family. I wanted Thomas to hear it. You need to be strong for Sarah now. You're right. I'm so proud of her. She's no career soldier, but there she is coping with all this reminds me of dad whatever was going on he put a smile on his face for us your family made you what you are he did his best with four daughters and a strong wife he always said live fire exercises was good prep for facing his girly horde your sister's waiting you'll be fine Right. Here we go. Okay. Remember the trip to the beach the summer before I left for basic training? Yeah, that sounded like a non sequitur. That didn't sound like it had a shit lot to do. Okay. Um, question is, do I need to talk to her anymore? Um, I'm going to save because I don't want to screw stuff up. But I'm going to talk to Ash one more time. See if she's good. I'll meet you back aboard the Normandy. Gotcha. You go do your thing. All right, now, nobody over here needed me, right? Okay, cool. Now, she, she's good. All right, anybody in here need me? Doesn't look like it. All right, I'll get down there in a minute. Hey there. Yeah, it's, that's not a good situation. Alright, nobody's in here. Nobody that needs me. Alright, let's go. Anybody here? Alright. Okay. Poker game still going on without James. A lot of us sorry, man. Wow. That's new. Okay, this. Anybody here need me? Nah, you guys are good. Alright, let's do this. What the hell are you guys doing up there?
He need you need anything, bud? Hey, I've assumed full control of Eclipse, and we're committed to moving forward with our Okay. There's nothing this galaxy can't beat if we all work together. Okay. Wow, my voice is pitched a little high, but whatever. Okay, anybody here need anything? Doesn't look like it. Looks like we're all good here. And you? I recognize you. You're Commander Shepard. And you must be Tactus. Heard the refugees consider you their leader. Yes, someone needs to sort out this mess. CSEC has tightened access to the Citadel, and we've got desperate people down here with no place to go. I also hear you need basic medical supplies. Dr. Chalkwist spoke of a mutually beneficial trade. I tried to be clear. In my experience, the Alliance looks out for their own. Trust is a hard thing to come by these days. I know you need our military supplies, but they're worth far more than your basic meds. Her offer wasn't satisfactory. Your people need our supplies, and my people need every edge we can get. Your combat-grade meds will make a difference. And our mission may just save everyone. Now's not the time for pettiness or mistrust. With our day-to-day -day worries, it's easy to forget we are all in this together. I'll have my people contact yours. You'll have your supplies as soon as possible. Thanks, bud. Now, I think that was all I have to do here. Let's keep it moving. See if there's anything else I can do. Alright, let's go on in. What's you? Thank you, you one. We will hold the pillars close to our hearts. Okay. To State Arms. Okay, so guns. I don't need any of this crap. State Arms. Who are you? James? Commander, what brings you down here? I was about to ask you that. Well, after our little chat, I made up my mind. I'm going to join the N7 program. And you're celebrating by getting a tattoo? <laughs> sort of. See, there's no official channels to go through right now. So, I guess this is my way of making it official. Technically, I'm just an N7 recruit, but, you know, I figure with you as my training officer, how could I fail? Right? I'm flattered, but I wouldn't exactly say I'm training you. Not officially, but what the hell is in this goddamn war? I'm just saying, whether you like it or not, you're my direct superior, and you're N7. So I take my lead from you, and you know, I'll take whatever advice you got. Really? Sure. The good advice. Well, they wouldn't ask you if they didn't think you could handle it. Here's hoping. But the real work starts now. Uh-huh. I know it seems like I don't take things seriously, but when I commit to something, I fully commit. Clearly. Hey, I won't let you down. The only person you need to prove yourself to is the one standing in the mirror every morning. Good point. You know, that's gonna sting for a few days. You gonna be ready for duty? Always. Hey, maybe we should get matching. You want me to get an N7 tattoo? N7? Sure. Or you could get my name done. Nope. Somewhere special. You're such a tease, Vega. Ew. Ooh, me? You ever gonna make good on all this flirting? Uh, I was just... I didn't mean to... You know, I was just... <laughs> That's what I thought. Later, Lieutenant. Later. That's why I don't like to talk to him, because it really... They take, they take it to flirting without you saying anything to really indicate that you are flirting because I didn't all I did was talk about a tattoo and they made her flirt with him no thank you not interested my commander Shepard is not bisexual All right, we did embassies, everything, so every we need to go back to the Normandy now. One moment, please. We're good. Now I'm going to take a quick look because sometimes there are people here. 
So there's a soldier on the viewing deck that I can talk to, so... Have you discovered a way to run FTL spaceships without an ESO core, Private Talavi? No, ma'am. Then consider this a serious assignment. Intel's expecting a Cerberus raid. Cerberus? Cerberus? They're a problem? I thought we were fighting Reapers, ma'am. Give it a week. You could be. Oof. That was nasty. All right, what do we got here? All right, anybody? Anybody? All right, let's go this way. Anybody? What about this guy? I recovered Prothean data drives from Garbug. I'll have them brought here. Commander Shepard. Thank you. I'm sure that'll help with uh, any operation we have going. Got it. All right, let's get back on the Normandy. Yes, let's return to the Normandy. And that is going to be the end of this particular episode. I'm going to thank you now for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Peace.